hi guys welcome to my channel i'm elizabeth thank you so much for tuning in and if you're new to my channel please be sure to subscribe comment and like it will be really really helpful if you subscribe and if you're new so i'm gonna show you quickly how i pack uh, some of my makeup items some of my essentials when i'm going for a vacation and i just want to share with you even though i'm not going for one uh so I, I really hope i can help somebody out there who is confused on what to pack so it depends if you're going for a family vacation or a vacation so i'm taking things from here so number one would say like the thing i'd pack if i was going for a vacation is like body oil i have this ancient greek uh remedy body oil so i'd pack like this or you can also pack a lotion and another thing i'd pack let's say you're going for a beach vacation maybe mombasa or anybody anywhere else you can all, always carry like a coconut oil so when you apply to your body it gives you that glow and trust me girl you need that glow when you're going for a vacation <laughs> So coconut oil, not only does it help for the body, but it can also help you to remove your makeup. So if this is too big to fit in your car bag, what you do is just take a smaller container and just put some of the oil in that container and you're good to go. Another thing I pack is like when you're going, let's say for a beach, uh, somewhere like mombasa or somewhere always carry a sunscreen doesn't matter how dark you think you are that you don't need one but always carry a sunscreen for your body and then another thing i do like for me i'd carry a hair oil this is a uh, afrolicious is also for the body so it does both it goes both ways so i carry like a hair oil it depends on how long your hair is and what your if you're braided just carry a spray so also at your ranch it's really important you can just carry one that is good and that will help and also another thing i carry is like perfumes i'm very very uh like i pack a lot of perfumes if i'm going somewhere but i'll just show you like i have three here this is internal phase it really smells nice i got this one from miniso and then i have this by there tuba rose it's like a body mist and then there's always this i don't know how to, i've forgotten how to pronounce this i don't know if it's if it's rosh rosha this one and then it's also body mist you can carry a perfume maybe a smaller one but a really good perfume that will help you for your ent entire vacation and also it depends if you're going for a vacation with a family you know some of the family members don't like this perfume so just carry something that is a bit the the smell is just mild not too much and then now when it comes to makeup it also depends on where you're going for a family vacation I don't see people playing makeup that much especially if you're traveling to rural areas so what you do is just carry like like skin treatment you can always carry your micellar water this is like a traveling package and if you have the bigger one just put it in the spray bottle and you're good to go and always carry your toner this is what I carry you carry your toner and then you can carry also a sunscreen for your face and what did i say that was you can also carry this uh vitamin c serum and another thing is like i have this uh, small moisturizer and then this high gel always hydrate your heart if you're going for a vacation and you know you always have to look like really really hot in this dinner date so you can carry your foundation mascara let me show you you can carry your primer start with your primer pack your primer pack your foundation the one you're using i use maybelline and this one is black opal so maybelline and black opal don't forget to carry your mascara your eyeliner 
another thing don't forget is to carry your concealers i have two i always carry two and then also if you know how to apply lashes just ca carry your lash and don't forget your tree your lash tre your tweezers so another thing you not to forget is your brushes just make sure you carry your brushes as little as you can just the few ones that you'll need don't carry brushes that you will not need try as much as possible even don't forget to carry your sponge for your foundation application don't for makeup just carry things that you need it depends on where you're going so if it, if you're going out with your family just carry things that are a bit not too much like lipstick carry nude lipsticks like this one i have here let's say these ones are nude lipsticks uh this one this one is also nude this one is a bit pink and these ones are like new they're not too much too much for a family vacation where your grandfather is there and <laughs> they're wondering what is wrong with you or your grandma so if you're going for a vacation always carry like this the red the maroon i'm sorry for the noise and sometimes also a lip gloss is good when you're going to the beach and you don't want to not necessarily for the beach anywhere you go you need to carry like that extra lip lip gloss so another thing i have here is a dental floss i like carrying this because sometimes it's good to have like really white teeth and i like i like clear teeth and white teeth so you don't want embarrass embarrassment so carry things what else are i not sure you? if you're going for let's say a bit of vacation please don't forget to carry your sunglasses and i have these bags that i got with some of these sunglasses so it's always good to pack them because this one can fit three so you try as much as possible to pack things in an organized manner and then another thing you're not to forget is your sanitary please never forget your sanitary i have this cute cute bag that i carry my sanitary in so here i have tissues i have uh, panty liners i have i have pads i have tampons and i also have elastoplast because accidents do happen and i have mobile cleaning wipes for my phone so for sanitary it doesn't matter if to that month thingy or not just carry extra in case something happens things do happen and you never really know if they happen and you get it so if i'm going for a vacation i'm sorry this is the kind of bag that i use to carry my makeup stuff so i make sure everything that i've showed you here they fit here and if they do not i try as much as possible to just get rid of some things to make sure that i carry the things that i need lastly also don't forget to carry your eyeshadow palette if you're going for a village just carry something small like this or something that has like really good nude colors that you wouldn't have to something this can fit anywhere in your bag and also a glow kit carry your matching colors like really good colors that will rhyme with your with your makeup and if you're not going for too long if you're going for only like three days just find some things that you'll carry in these small bags if i'm going somewhere far for like three days i just use this one because it will depend maybe i'll do my makeup only once in a day or maybe not at all so i just carry my skincare and my sanitary pads with this and put them in my, my small bag and i'm good to go so that is what i i carry when i'm going somewhere i'm not i'm not doing a cloth thing but i'll come and show you uh, what clothes I, I pack and it's always nice to like if you're packing be sure to try your clothes your outfit out try them and carry the things that you need and also check the weather before you travel check the weather so you know how to pack your stuff so i hope i've helped when it comes to packing your makeup and thank you so much for watching this uh don't forget to subscribe if you're, if you're new to my channel thank you so much i love you and have a good day and happy happy december bye
Oh, I forgot. Sorry, I said bye and I forgot to tell you. Please carry your wipes, your baby wipes, whatever wipes you use. These are so nice because they're so moist. And then, and then another tip to even make them more moisture when you're packing, just let the fa this side face a downward. So when you remove one from here, it comes even more moist. And another thing I'll say is like, just take like a few of the earbuds and put them in your like a, a cotton or a paper towel wrap them around and carry them uh if you're going for a vacation maybe you've the room always have like the sewing kit but if you're traveling just make sure you put something like this and that thread i don't know where my thread is it's always nice because things happen and you want to wear clothes and it's torn what do you do this one comes in handy so also a tip i forgot to tell you with the tweezers not necessarily when you have uh, like lashes you can always ca carry them so when you want to go out and you see like there's something you have like your eyebrows are not really good so I just twist them out and you'll be okay so i think that's it i think i've not forgotten anything else another tip i'll tell you like if you're going for a vacation just carry a book like one book an interesting book that you can always so it's nice to wake up early if you're going for a family vacation take a shower and prepare yourself and read your book while you wait for the others to wake up so that's that bye for the second time love you <laughs>